The status for Graham Mertz on Saturday is still up in the air, but it's better than what appeared to be after the game. Mertz left the third quarter with a chest injury and was taken to the hospital. He was released later that night. The Badger QB is officially listed as questionable for the Illini game, but Mertz watched film Sunday and practiced today and says he's all good. I took a breath and felt a little bit different, so I had to go get evaluated. Just Make sure everything was all right structurally and um, in the organs, so it's all good. All the tests, all the. I, I gotta be careful because I'm not a doctor, but you know everything's he's good that way, and um, it was good today. You always want to play, so I'm gonna do whatever I can to make sure I, I can put myself in the best position. But I feel good. Now, if Mertz can't go, Chase Wolf will make his first career start as a Badger. He appeared in eight games over a span of three years where he threw a total of 20 passes. Two of them were touchdowns, four others were interceptions. Wolf said after Saturday's loss that he's preparing to be the starter, but added he does that every week. Now, the Badger blueprint is what we do every Wednesday during the football season. And here's your reminder to tune into this week's episode. Wisconsin State Journal columnist Jim Polzine and I will have more on Mertz. And the familiar face Wisconsin will be going against on Saturday.